Okay, our next uh, series is gonna be the one hand the collar series. So when you grab the one hand the collar, give me a thumb down, give me a thumb up, and a thumb to the side. Okay, that's gonna be our three grips that we're gonna work on. So the first one is the thumb down. The thumb downs are, are a lot like the, the drags. So this grip is more when you kind of pull you. So we're gonna go back to like the hand grips basically. I'm gonna do the same, same grip with the sandwich grip here. I'm gonna do the same 130 foot, uh, foot 35 degree stance here. I'm gonna do the same pull back. Um, the difference here is that he's controlling the shoulder line, so to speak, whereas earlier we had a hand line where we have an extra you know, length of your arm. So when I step like this, my seat work doesn't make that much of a difference as long as you're in our, our, our white stance here. But when you hold the collar line here, when I get my grip and he like pulls me, I'm gonna step, and I always wanna step behind the foot line. Okay? And I do everything exactly the same after that, everything that's turned over. I do the, I'm already at the turn and I do everything else the same. The same exact straight arm bar. Um, the biggest difference here is uh, as I step, I always step behind the leg. If I step in front of the leg here, I can get a great base, but then he can kick my leg out and drag you around some more. Just trying to rent as many uh, details as possible or randomness as possible. Okay, so here, I get my grip here, I always step behind. I'm trying to leave my shoulder over my knee, over my foot that we talked about last time. I'm already on the back step here. All I'll do is my prop step here, elbow down, and back. Everything's pretty much very similar to the hand. Ready? One, two, three. 